Hey everybody, how you doing? I hope everybody's doing great today. This is a battle you've probably seen before. We're in Alliance War, Symbiotes versus Asgardians. Go after Hela's minions, and pretty soon you've built up your speed, and you're going to roll on to an easy win. But we're not here to talk about my Alliance War battles today. We're here to talk about the Hawk. The Hawk is our Alliance War MVP every single war. He does 25 million war damage. I've got the most power in our alliance, but on a good day, I do 18 million war damage. Probably I average between 13 and 15 million. So I thought maybe if we looked at the Hawk's war attacks, maybe I'd learn something and maybe you guys could learn something. So let's see what we can pick up from picking apart his alliance war. So his first battle, he teams up Doom with the Secret Avengers, and he takes on a huge Marauders team. And if you're, by the way, if you're wondering which of these battles are wins and losses, this guy never loses. Every single battle is a win for him. So you hear about Doom teaming up with the Brotherhood to make a nice defensive team. He makes a choice, put Doom on offense. And then like you see me doing in the background, his symbiotes punch up against Asgardians. He, his X-Force takes on the first wave Avengers. I don't have a Skilletary team. He's got a Skilletary team that he uses against mercenaries. And then his Hydra team takes on first wave Avengers. He adds vision to the typical Hydra team of Zemo, Red Skull, Winter Soldier, Hydra, Grenadier. And I'll have to ask him why he added Vision. Uh, Black Order against Black Order, Mirror Match. His Power Armor team easily takes on the Wakandans. And then you're going to start to see the Eternals in uh, Alliance War. Takes on a big Emma and Marauders team. And then he's gone. He goes to sleep or he goes to work or something. He's already done eight attacks, 18 million already. And I thought it was going to be an easy war. It turns out the war got close at the end. So now he comes back and he's going to do some more attacks the last hour of war. So he takes a team I like, Shadowlands, and beats a shield team, a tough shield team with Kestrel. His uncanny X-Men do some work. They punch down a little bit against Fantastic Four. He teams up Captain Marvel with X-Factor to beat another Kestrel Shield team. I think I'm going to try that combination, X-Factor and Captain Marvel. Um, now the war is basically done, and he hasn't even used his Infinity Watch or Weapon X yet. Look at how much he helped his alliance before he even got his big teams out. So another MVP for the Hawk, 25 million damage. Um, hopefully that gave you some ideas. It gave me some things to try. I'm gonna go Doom on offense. I wanna see how he used Vision and Captain Marvel. Can I incorporate some of that? So hopefully it helped us all out. Another thing to watch out for in war is the Eternals and Silver Surfer. You're going to start to see them take on big teams, and you can use them as your third team to take out a hero for hire. Jesus Christ. That's Jason Bourne.